Hello everyone, Dolphin Oracle here again today, coming at you again from Annex World, where we have a new app in the Annex repositories. It's called One One Voice. It is installable from the default default repositories. Just fire open Synaptic and find One to One Voice. And one, two, and there it is. One to one voice annex. Right click on that, install it as you would any other app. I've already installed it, so I'm going to skip the download and install part. After it's installed, it's going to show up in your Annex menu under Applications, Internet, and One to One Voice. I'll click on One to One Voice. It's going to ask which one you want to do. Now you can provide or you can call. If you click on Provide, you're going to get a Mumble server started with its own SSL encryption certificate so that you can make an encrypted call between another party. Another party can dial into you. Like one-to-one -one assistance on the screen sharing side, it, the other party is going to dial in. You're going to have to do some port forwarding if you're on a home network uh, unless you got set up in the outside an outside world. So here we go. We have here's the server. Now someone can dial in to me. You've got a text. You can you can you can chat down here. Hello, this is Dolphin Oracle. Okay, you can do that. But you know anybody can text chat. So what you really want is is the 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 chat. So the first time you launch, you're going to actually go through the audio wizard. This is the audio wizard. And it's going to ask you to set up your device. Just make sure you pick. There's a could be a long list. So just make sure you pick the right one off the list. You may have to go through it a couple of times. You should be able to hear yourself in your headphones while you're making these changes. Same thing with the output device. Make sure you choose the right one. I'm using an external USB mic and my default headphones. On this Tice, you should hear test audio to let you know how loud it's going to be. This is uh, kind of a tuner, and you want most of your voice to be in the green with none in the red while you speak. I set mine about here. You can you can twist this up and down a little bit, but this will give you the best results so that you don't get like a lot of feedback issues. This fine tuning is important to avoid feedback or echo effects. So this is the raw amplitude. Uh, this is like uh, the microphone can tell when to transmit by how your own voice. So you want this with nothing in the red and your voice in the green. So when you speak, it will transmit. I have never changed these features, so I just go ahead and leave them. Um, it's bandwidth issues. Now, the def default balanced, I find not much difference between a really good telephone call. Now, you should hear positional audio test here. If you get all that squared away correctly, your audio is going to look good. We do have an FAQ in the in docs slash share slash annex. Let me uh, pull that up. Let me say slash user slash share slash annex. I mean, is what I meant to say. FAQ and then one to one voice at HTML. And it's going to give you a great, it's going to include fine tuning options, how to do multiple systems from a single location. All, this is a, a terrific user guide, well written for a layperson to read. It's very useful. Screenshots showing you what to click and when. So that's there for you. It will eventually be linked to the main Annex FAQ. It may be by the time you see this video. So it may show up in the regular FAQ down here. Let's see, da, 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 Annex, Annex FAQ, FAQ, uh, it's not showing up in mine yet, but that should be any time. It'll be linking to the main documentation so you can find it easier than going through slash user slash share slash Annex. So I'm going to close, I, we have, my son is upstairs, and he has 
The other half of he has this set up on one-to-one -one voice upstairs. He's on the receive side. So I'm going to close Mumble server and I'm going to call him. Applications, internet, one-to-one -one voice. And I'm going to call. Now here's where you're going to need the port forwarding if you are the remote caller. Use something like uh, uh, what's my IP or something like that to get it to you. But we're on the home net right now, so I can dial a direct IP address without all the port forwarding. Now here we are. We're connected. Now the first we've already connected once, but the first time you connect, you're going to get an install. You're going to get an accept certificate, and that's what you want to have for for uh, that that ensures the encryption certificate. We've already is secure. We've already exchanged certificates. So Alex, can you hear me? Yes, I can. All right. So say hi to the Antics YouTube community. Hello, Antics YouTube community. All right. And I want to thank Al for helping me out with this video. Uh, anyway, for tips, tricks, how-tos, head over to annex.mepis.org or throw up a post at annex.freeforms.org. This is Dolphin Oracle signing off. Have a great day.